guys, welcome back to the Hubian Talent Channel. My name is Stella Bella, and today we are going to be reviewing this V face lifting machine. So, if you want to know whether it works or not and how it works, stay tuned. Okay, so as you'll probably know by now, I'm a very big fan of Korean beauty products. And I saw this product advertised quite a lot amongst the Korean crowds, but of course I wasn't gonna pay like $200 for a machine that I'm not sure whether will work or not. But then I found a cheaper alternative on Amazon and it had a lot of great reviews. So I thought, okay, let's give it a shot. This one costs I think maybe 30, 35, $40. And looks exactly the same as the Korean branded ones, except this one I think is a Chinese brand called Anlan, Anlan, and it did come highly rated on Amazon. So today we're gonna see how it works and if it works. So when you take it out of the packaging, it looks like this. So it's got the machine here, it's got a remote control, a USB charging cable, and also the strap that goes around the head, and also the instruction manual, which is translated in English and Japanese. Now first, let me take it out of the package. So this is what it looks like. So this is the part that goes around your face like this. Right. So the purpose of this machine is to give your chin, your jaw, that V shape that, um, that us girls are always pining for. Ooh. So it goes to your chin like that. And then with the strap that it comes with, it will connect through these parts, so like that. And you can adjust it as well. So that will go around your head once it's on. And the cable you can use for charging, which I think the charging port is here. So you can just charge that with a portable battery or um, some sort of power source here. And it also comes with a remote control i do wonder though why do you need a remote control for something that is connected to your head like isn't the whole point of having a remote control is to be able to control it if you're far away like is someone else going to control it i certainly hope not not when this thing's on my head now on the machine itself it also has an on button and a mode button. So the mode button selects which mode you want this to actually be in. And there are actually six different modes to this machine. So according to the instructions, there is the lift, so it helps you lift your face and your, your chin. The V face mode, which is to get that, the chin effect. Therapy, um, I'm guessing if you just want some sort of relaxation function sterilize so if i suppose if you've got um i don't know acne or um, problem skin areas and you want to to cleanse the cells a little bit um the anti-acne mode and also the rejuvenate mode it's actually quite high tech for um for just your chin <laughs> so let's give it a shot let's make sure this is turned off first oh so if you have a look at the remote control, if you press the button, you'll see this one, I think, shows the battery. Yeah, the battery. And this bottom, this bottom button here shows the level of strength, I suppose. And if I go mode, so it will change to a different mode with each one. So yeah, pretty snazzy. So I'm guessing you can do the same with these buttons here, but of course, I guess once it's on your face, you can't really see what you're doing. So the remote control helps. Okay, so being an EMS machine, what it basically does is it uses electrical muscle stimulation, which is what EMS stands for. I've got a friend who works in cosmetology and she actually told me that, um, she actually explained to me the whole point of Botox and a lot of people using Botox as um, the muscle relaxant inside these muscles here is that a lot of us, particularly particularly if we have TMJ, we tend to grind our teeth or like tense our jaw up quite a lot, um, even when we're sleeping. This will then bulk up the muscles here. So try if you like, if you clench your jaw now, you can see it, it kind of makes your face a little bit wider. And if these muscles are quite tense and quite tight, 
It'll make your face a lot more broader and wider. So the whole point of putting Botox in is to relax these muscles. And then if you add in extra work, like um, a skin tightening and that sort of thing, it then creates the look of a smaller, slimmer face. So the point of EMS is to use the electrical muscle stimulation to relax the muscles and create the effect that Botox will have. Obviously, Botox will be a lot quicker, but for those who can't afford it or um, are just not into um, those sort of treatments, this would be a much better alternative. Although, of course, it will take a lot longer and there's no guarantee that it will work either. Now, before you get started, you want to make sure that the two electrical nodes here are never dry. So when it connects to your face, in order for it to work, you will need to put some gel on there. Some of these products sometimes have special gel that comes with it, but otherwise just plain 100% aloe vera gel would be good. You can also use moisturizer as well, but just make sure whatever you use, don't make it oil-based because oil can actually damage the silicone, which is what the rest of the product is made of. So I'm gonna use my aloe vera gel and I'm gonna put a little bit onto each of the nodes there. Just a dollop each and just spread it around. So I do expect this to be quite messy, but we'll clean that off later. Okay, so I've just spread the gel around onto each side. Okay, I'm gonna put this on. I'm gonna look very, very special when I do it. Okay, I'm gonna make, make sure the machine is turned off first though. Always make sure it's turned off, okay. And it's gonna sit, I'm gonna put this bottom part. So there's actually like a little, um, you see there's a little um, divot right there. I'm gonna put my chin in here. Connect that to the face, click it in place. Ooh. And I'm gonna bring that strap around to the other side and connect it. Okay, I'm just readjusting that to the back of my head. <gasps> Looking very special right now. Can you see like in K-dramas, you always see people use this sort of stuff. And you're like, oh, that's how they look so beautiful. But really, I feel like they do something a little bit extra than just this. But anyway, okay, so now this is on and I'm going to turn it on. So I've got the two nodes pretty much in the, the tight parts of my face. So the parts where if I clench down those if, and I touch that those would be the parts that feels um, sort of the hardest, the toughest, the most muscular. Okay, I'm going to turn this on. Oh, okay. So that is on. And you can see the light emitting already. And I'm also going to turn the remote control on. Okay. So now this is on the lift function. Let's go through the modes. Let's see if the color changes. So lift. Oh, that is V-Face. So V-Face doesn't have a light. Therapy, ooh, therapy is a red light. Sterilize is also red. Anti-acne is red. Rejuvenate is blue. Hmm. Let's go to lift. Let's see if that works. Okay, now I'm gonna turn it up. See if we feel it. So one, two. Oh, I'm starting to feel something. Now I'm feeling it both sides. Oh, ooh. This is, Level five out of six. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can actually feel like it just sends some like electrical pulses into the cheeks and it's just going bzz, bzz. But it's just, and then it stops. Like it, I don't know if some of you have ever tried um, the electrical um, muscle stimulation. It kind of just sends these like currents into your muscles, which kind of makes your muscles seize up a little bit while the current's going and then it relaxes and then it goes back in. So that's what it's doing at the moment. 
So they ha it has small pauses. So it's it pulses, 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 and then it pauses, and then it goes again. Oh my gosh, I can't even speak with this on. Like I can feel it in my lips, I can feel it in my face. I feel like one side, and I don't know, maybe it's because my face is not symmetrical and like one side of my jaw is tighter than the other because I feel like my um, my right side feels it a little more than the left. I'm going to try to turn it up to the highest, see how it goes. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Can you... It's actually so ridiculous. Okay, I'm gonna turn it down a bit. Let's go back to five. Okay. Now, if I was here by myself and I wasn't recording, I would probably leave it on the highest and just do it. But I'm well aware that it may end up turning into a horror video if I did that. So I'm just gonna leave it at five and just to test how it goes. But you can actually feel it. Like you can feel it pulsing into your muscles and getting deeper into the muscles that normally if you just try to massage your face, you wouldn't get to. You can actually feel it going deep into the muscles to try to relax it. And I guess the idea is that once your muscles are relaxed and if you apply um, skincare products that help with skin tightening and that sort of thing, eventually it'll create that V-shaped face. So I'm just gonna let this run. <laughs> Maybe I'll do it at the highest. And now I'll come back once I wanna take it off and see and see how it goes. Okay, so. I've just taken it off. I'm gonna wipe the gel from my face. I mean, to be honest, I can't really tell the difference. I don't think it's that immediate. I mean, I definitely do feel that it's, it feels less tense. So from a muscular perspective, I feel like if you have, if you have a bad habit of clenching your jaw all the time or in your sleep, which I do, um, I do um, tend to clench my jaw quite a bit in my sleep and it gets quite tight there in the mornings. This is actually really good to loosen it up. I feel like it's a lot looser. Whether it looks different or it gives me more of a V-shaped face, um, I'm not too sure, I can't really tell, but it's certainly good as a facial massager. Of course, do not overdo it. It is EMS, so it is using electrical currents in your face. Um, and it's close to your eyes and your head and all the important parts. So don't overdo it. This machine actually turns off after 10 minutes on its own. But if you get a machine that doesn't do that, make sure you do time yourself so you don't overdo it because everything in moderation, the instructions on this says to use it maybe three or four times a week. When you first start off, maybe you wanna try once a week just to see how it goes and maybe just a couple of minutes at a time to work yourself up towards it rather than going straight in full blast. But overall, I would not pay $200 or whatever it is for something like this. I feel like it's a, that would be a bit pricey, but for the $20, $30 on Amazon, I feel like it is worth it just for a little bit of a, I don't know, facial massage product. Um, just a little bit of self-care, that's quite cheap, but do make sure you are picking one that has high reviews from reputable sources as well. That's it from me today. Thank you so much for listening. Thank you for joining us at the Hubian channel as well. Make sure you subscribe, like, follow, comment, do all of that. We're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, um, all of the social medias, TikTok. Um, so do make sure you follow us. And if you've got any questions or comments, please type it in below. We would love to hear from you, especially um, any content that you wanna see from us next or from any of our Hubian talents. Please follow me as well. My Instagram and Facebook is stellabella.au. I would love to hear from you on any one of those platforms. Or if you've got any other products that you're interested in that you want us to review as well, let us know because I'm always up for an excuse to buy more things to try. Thank you so much for listening. Until next time, stay safe and healthy and we'll see you soon. Bye.